Okay, guys, I'm going to show you how to deal with iMac freezing. Any Apple computer that you might be having that's freezing up quite a bit. My computer was freezing up sometimes it was two, three times a day. Um, it would freeze up if I had lots of Safari tabs open. Um, if I was playing around with anything to do with QuickTime. And also it was crashing when I'd open up uh, Final Cut and things like that. So what to do when your iMac is freezing or your Apple MacBook Pro, whatever, doesn't matter what product you've got, this is the steps to take. First step is to go into your applications, scroll down to utilities, open that up, and you're gonna see this here, disk utility. Command O or double click with the mouse, Either or is going to open it up. So double click this utility. Okay. And it's going to ask you to select a disk volume or image. You're going to select the first. This is your startup disk right here. And this is where your computer starts up from this drive, the Macintosh HD. In my case, it's a 640 gig Hitachi. Um, and there is the details of it, right? This is where my computer starts up from. So what we're gonna do first is verify disk, repair disk. Now it says here, if repair disk is unavailable, click verify disk. Well, we're gonna click repair disk. Now mine was nice and clean. And the reason was because I've already done this, but you'll find that your, your actual, this will just fill up with all these things and it will take up to 20 minutes, could even take an hour. Just let it do its work. It will go through and clean up everything that's a problem. The next thing to do is to go into this one and do verify disk. And you'll actually do this in stages. So you'll do this. This is going to stop your computer from crashing. This is going to stop all those problems from happening. Software that has problems, you name it. Now, this will find all the problems. Okay. Then what you're going to do, once this is done, and remember what I said, yours will probably take a little bit longer. So you start with this one, do repair disk, go to this one. If it doesn't allow repair disk, do start you know, verifying. Then what you do is you go back again and you'll actually do these two. These are the ones, verify disk permissions, repair disk permissions. What's happened, I believe, is that all of your software, QuickTime, if you've put in a, a driver for a printer or a scanner, if you've put in some sort of software, I had problems with Safari and it was showing all these things that were wrong and it was fixing them all up. So what you've got to do is let this finish. Don't stop anything and let it finish. And ideally you don't have any other software running, but just let it do all of its work. Okay, so we've got uh, the verified disk phase finished. As you can see, uh, the volume Macintosh appears to be okay. What you could then do is repair disk permissions. So I'm gonna click that now, and this is where I saw all of the repairs. This is where it all happened. So it was on this. Click that button there after you've done verify disk. You could have done repair disk if it allowed it, but it didn't, so I just did verify disk, and now I've clicked this one, and this is where all the problems happened for me earlier. Of course, now I've already gone through this step, so this is uh, not gonna be as bad, but it still may find some issues, and they're the ones that were causing the computer to crash. Hopefully, this will work for you, and uh, it will stop the computer crashing as much as it was. I mean, I was crashing pretty much every time I'd open up Final Cut Pro or QuickTime Movie Player or Safari. So mine was crashing quite a bit. Like I said, um, now you can see here repairing permissions estimated, there's, there's, there's actually issues still after I've done a few repairs. So believe it or not, this could take a while and that'll just go through and repair everything. The other thing you can do then is once the repairs have happened, just restart your computer or um, 
shut it down and then restart it again and hopefully that's all fixed up for you hope that helps guys and uh cheers for watching